What is going on everybody? So today I'll be showing you guys a few items you might want to pick up from Miss Mendoza the gun runner. If you guys don't know how to find her, the best way to find her is find a snitch. The snitch will give her location and as you guys can see on the map, it is this white shopping cart. So let's see what she has. So she has a scalpel. I don't really like this one at all. I don't really use it for anything, but it does come with future perfection. Weapon kills grant plus one skill tier for 19 seconds. Now this does stack up to three times. Weapon kills at skill tier six grant overcharge for 15 seconds. Overcharge cooldown 90 seconds. There's a lot of different ways you guys can get overcharged in this game. Um, I just don't think this sniper is really the one for you. Now this punch drunk mash is actually a pretty good one. I'm gonna tell you guys that because it has pistol damage, right? It always comes with 20% headshot damage, and then it has that weapon damage on there that you can max out, and it has armor regen. So if you guys are trying to build a pistol armor regen build, this could be the perfect rolls for you. So it's not too often that you get pieces like this with armor regen. So if you guys are looking for that type of build, well, yeah, this is going to cost you 15,000 credits. Now remember, they do have the shield splinter, yes, and this is, you need to get the 12 masks from DC to have this pop up here. The rolls are pretty decent. I will swap out the swap speed for damage targets out of cover. And this always comes with perfect optimus. Same thing with the hunter killer. You got to get the 13 mask from New York City. Now this one has some weird rolls because this golden gear gives you status effects. But look at this. It has armor, skill damage, status effects, and it always comes with perfect intimidate. So if you've been looking at something for some, some, some crazy rolls like this, I haven't seen something like this in a while, then this might be something for you and you can swap out whatever you want. Now, the next piece I would recommend picking up if you guys have been looking at picking up some type of tip of the spear build. Now this gives you weapon damage, critical hit chance. I would put headshot damage and this is actually great for those sniper builds. Now you can run the backpack or you can just run all the other pieces like I do. But yeah, if you guys have been looking at trying to put the build together, well, there you go. They do have an aces and ace chest piece, which I don't really use the chest piece because you can use headhunter. Um, you can use a gold piece that's going to give you a lot more damage. Now this does have weapon damage, hazard protection. Now hardwire piece always comes with skill tier and then you can roll skill damage, status effects, whatever you want on there. So this is actually a piece if you guys have been looking at putting a hardwire build together. They do have some aces and eights knee pads with weapon damage. I would swap out that crit chance for headshot damage. And there you go. You got some, some pretty solid aces and eight knee pads. The Hunter Fury um, holster, another piece, weapon damage. I would roll crit damage on there, crit chance. And another really good piece. And then the mask, negotiator's mask with weapon damage. And then I would roll the repair skills for crit chance or crit damage. So yeah, a lot of pretty good pieces if you guys have been looking for that. Um, this AUG isn't too good. The Urban MDR, another one not too good. They have Hana Yu Gloves that has 10% skill haste for the one piece. This one has skill tier, skill haste, repair skills. You can run this a lot of different ways. Um, if you guys have been looking at some type of skill haste, repair skill build with Hana Yu, this might be a piece that you could put on your build. So this could be a decent piece right here. Now this is a piece that I actually use on one of my armor regen builds and that's because it has armor, crit chance, crit damage on there. And remember the Bellstone one piece gives you 1% armor regen. So if you're looking at doing a tank armor regen and you wanna have those red rolls, well this is the piece for you, 5,600 credits. They do have an offensive um, system mod right here with 4.7% 4, 4 crit chance. I think they had that in the vendors this week and then they have a radius on their a radius mod so yeah the bellstone armory holster probably the one that i would pick up if you are into um gold gold gear skill builds repair skill builds well this is probably another piece for you and then if you need any of these pieces typically with all gold pieces sorry with all green pieces besides eclipse i typically don't use the chest or backpack so these all work really good and these two probably wouldn't run it and then this punch truck mask is another pickup that I would pick up. And that's about it, guys. If you guys have any questions, if you guys want to know anything else, let me know in the comment section. I will be wrapping up the video here. I'll see you in the next one. Until then, hey, nothing but skills up.